And this month is Distracted Driving Awareness Month, and a West Michigan family impacted by the issue is hoping to make a major impact. Last year, David Talsma was killed after a driver looking at a GPS and eating a sandwich crashed into their family van. Today, Jason Talsma is with us here in studio to talk about that issue that he hopes his story might be able to resonate and really make an impact. You're going to be talking with the Ottawa County Sheriff's Department tomorrow, doing a press conference in hopes of really sharing your message. Jason, thanks for being with us. Um, what uh, a lot of families would think, you know, this kind of tragedy would make you not want to talk about it. Why are you, why are you, do you feel this is so important? I just feel it's uh, just honoring and of David and his uh, what he did to try to make a difference um, in little ways and sometimes in ways that we didn't know. Um, so I just want to, I'm doing that to make him proud. Yeah. What's your message going to be tomorrow? Yeah, and I want to talk about the, the impact that it has um, personally um, over distracted driving and also um, just kind of this weird space that we're in where... Um, Technology is part of the problem, but it's also part of the solution. So um, with the way that cars can even break themselves. So that could be part of a solution. Yeah. It's almost been a year. What has the past several months been like for your family in terms of healing from this? It has gone through lots of different stages. Um, stages of anger, depression, to, to just the joy that you remember with David. But um, yeah, we're in a, a lot different place than we were earlier on but um, there's still a lot of healing to be done yeah. and uh, I remember at the court hearing that you were able to see face to face this person that um, that ultimately was responsible for this obviously it was an accident uh, this person was a person that drove as part of their profession a lot of folks think I'm a better driver than the next guy right. and this really sends home the message that nobody can do this while right drive while doing other things. Right, and the reality is we're not. And that's why I just think we just really need to be conscious while we're on the road, whether you're a passenger or a driver. Um, the passengers have a responsibility as well to help out the driver, help them navigate if they need to, or um, whatever it is, um, maybe not be a distraction themselves. So, How did you develop this partnership with the Sheriff's Department to, for tomorrow's event? Gotcha, that just kind of came about um, through the Michigan Office of Highway Safety Planning. They're um, coordinating this event, and um, yeah, they, they really are trying to um, make that more of a, something that we're, we're aware of, and we realize that this is a killer. Right. Yeah. This is what you think David would want, would want you to be doing? Absolutely. No doubt about it. All yeah. right. Mm -hmm. Well, we hope to be at that event tomorrow. We plan to be. And uh, Jason, thank you for sharing your story you. again. And, you know, we never know what kind of impact it has, but certainly hope someone hears this and Absolutely. is more careful on the road. Yes. All right.